we start with weekly charges. I wanna give a quick update. And as we can see, after we get this correction based on weekly, the price continue really sharp. And we see the breakout of the all time high and the highest price we get somewhere around 5.9. Now I wanna see what's the next mostly. We can expect the price to consolidate here for longer time before we see the continuation anyway. I want to see how we can look for trade. And if you move to daily chart, you want to see whether we can look at this one as a flat. All right. What we get here in this information is not really clear for us for to look for the next direction. But for mostly, we're looking at this one. And if you get any opportunity for buyers, a reversal will take it. But as I mentioned, we can expect the price to consolidate here for longer time to see the continuation, which the price can break 5.9 or tag 5.9 again. By the way, we want to see how we can look for traders. We want to see whether we can get any opportunity for buy or not. And if you move to forward chart, now the question is how to look at this one. Whether we can put this two in relative to each other. If I want to put this one as a correction relative to this, the next one have to drop at least tag the lowest price of this one or at least tag the lowest price of here before we see the reversal. All right. That's mean we can expect this one to turn to more complex before we see the reversal, then how we can look at this one. And even if I want to put this one as a correction relative to this, I don't think this is the only flat. And I don't think this is the one is going to break the previous top. That's why if we want to look for buy, if the price continues a sharp move is good for us. But we can expect this one even tend to flat for the next drop as a one, two, three in relative to this before we get the last wave then how to look for trade, whether we should look for buy or not. If anyone wants to look for buy, if the price continues a corrective move, they need to be really careful about the next drop. As what I explained, we can look at this one as internal flat in relative to what I have here. That's why I mentioned the best things is if the price could tag the lowest price, at least the lowest price of this correction, at least somewhere around three before we see the reversal. All right? Because if the price reverse from here, we can expect this one turn to a extension by the way based on forward chart we don't see any trade setup either for buy or sell and if you move to one hour chart if anyone wants to look for buy for those traders they get the trade for buy from here right now move their sub loss to break even if they want to keep the trade and if anyone wants to look for buy from here they have to wait for the flag they put their entry above the top in that case we want to price tag sharply and continue if the price tag we see is not moving we shouldn't keep the trade more than two hours and after that we need to see the breakout of desktop we need to see the breakout of 3.9 flowing by 4.2 because if the price continue as a corrective we see the price the way is moving is really corrective we should keep a take out the trade for buy and we should look at this one as a flat in relative to this correction for the next drop this is where we can look for sell anyway at this point i don't see any trades of the way there for buy sell i'm not really interested to look for any trade i prefer to wait before I take the next trade, because I want to see what's the next, I want to get the proper trade setup that can give me clear direction for the next move. Anyway, uh, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.